Hello and welcome to the next session in this machine learning course. Till now we have already covered some basics of Python. We have looked at a few Python libraries like NumPy, Pandas and Matplotlib and we have already covered some introduction part of machine learning. Okay? So I think now it is the perfect time to look at a few algorithms. The first one I want to discuss is linear regression. So by now we already know what regression problems are. So this linear regression is basically an algorithm for solving regression problems. Okay? So as an example, let me consider a problem of housing data set where we will be given the area of a house. Let's say we are given the area of a house in square feet. We will have to predict the price of the house that at what price that house should be sold. Okay? So for obviously for solving this problem, I need some training data. Let's say I have the data of last 100 houses sold okay last 100 houses sold so I have data something like this that if the house is of 2000 square feet it got sold at 70 lakhs okay uh, if it was of 1500 square feet it got sold at 50 lakhs for 2500 let me write it at 90 lakh and so on okay and so on so if I try to plot this on a graph, okay, so basically this is my y and this is my x. So this is x that is square fit and this is price. So if I just plot all these 100 points on this graph, okay, so let's assume that these are 100 points. So now what linear regression is going to try and do is it's going to try and build a linear relationship between my dependent and independent variable. Okay. So what which is dependent variable that is y that is price. Okay. So it is going to try and build a linear relationship. So when we say that linear relationship between two variables, what does that mean? That simply means that it is the equation of a line. Okay. Equation of a line. So basically an equation something looking like this is going to be built y is equal to mx plus c where m is going to be my slope c is going to be my intercept okay i hope everyone knows that y is equal to mx plus c is the general equation of a line okay uh, and what is basically y y is our price and x is our square fit so if we know the values of m and c, like if we are able to find out the optimal values of m and c, then if someone gives me the value of x that is square fit, our y is going to come out. Okay, So we are able to get y accordingly. So what is what we are going to do is, what linear regression will try and do is, it is going to try to build a line out of these data points. So a line such that which is able to explain my training data, that is these 100 points very well. Obviously a line such as this makes not much sense okay the line would look something similar to this okay something similar to this so a line like this is able to explain my data really well that almost all of my data is lying very close to the line so basically we have to try to find a line linear regression tries to find a line which is able to explain our training data really well that which is the line which is quite close to the training data Obviously, it cannot, it cannot cover all the points, but it will try to be as close to most of the points. Okay? Yeah. This line is also known as best fit line. Okay? Just assume that we are able to find out the line somehow. Don't worry about how we are exactly going to do it. Uh, right now, just focus on that we have found out the line, what we are going to do with that line. Okay? So let's say after some calculations we are able to find out the line and this is the line which I have already made and this is my final line. Now what I am going to do with that? Now in future some person comes to me and tells me that he has a house of let's say 3000 square feet. Okay? At what price should, we, should he be selling it? At what price should he be selling his house? Now what I am going to say is, okay, I am going to say, okay, so you have a 3000 square feet house according to me your house should be sold at let's say 
1.1 crores okay let's say 1.1 crores okay so your house is going to be sold at 1.1 crores it was 90 lakh over here in 2500 not 90000 uh, similarly over here 50 lakhs yeah so your house should be sold at 1.1 crore if you are having 3000 square feet area okay so this is some of how the calculations are going to be made it is going to be simply done on the base of our best fit lines okay uh, once the line has been made the training data we don't look at training data anymore all those hundred points were helpful to make the line and now all the calculations are going to be based on that line okay even if some person comes to me with a value of 2500 I won't be looking at my training data now I won't be saying my answer is 90 lakh I will look at this let's say over here if I look at over here 2500 so obviously this is my point for 90,000 okay so this is this is this point is for 90,000 but I am going to predict this point basically the point lying on the line my prediction might be somewhere 95 lakh okay so what I'm trying to say over here is that all the predictions are always going to be based on the best fit line and not on the training data okay the training data was only helpful to make the model that is make the line okay it only helped us to get the best fit line it won't be helping us in predictions in predictions we have to use the best fit line itself okay basically it will be helping us to build the line that is to get the values of m and c now how to get the values of m and c this i'll discuss in the next session thank you